Uh, just real quick, uh, hit a used bookstore today and I wanted to share with you what I purchased there. Uh, I'm just gonna make this quick and easy so the camera might be a little shaky. Okay, this is John Seymour's Self-Sufficient Life and How to Live It. Uh, complete back to basics guide. Uh, leaf through it real quick there, leaf through it again a little bit ago. It's pretty handy. I just want you to see what the cover looks like there. Same thing on the inside of the paper cover, in case you're looking to purchase. Uh, I bought it for, you can't see that, I'm sure, $12.50. But uh, it's pretty decent. There's a lot of, a lot of stuff to it. Um, from, you can see there, the meaning of self-sufficiency. But it goes into, you know, everything. Garden plants. Uh, cultivation, more plants, more plants and gardening, uh, and how to take care of the plants as you're growing them, sowing seeds indoors, okay, a lot of garden stuff, vegetables through the year, um, what to do with stuff, how to do different things, uh, I think that one was about rooting grapes, uh, all sorts of fruit tree, espaliers, uh, things like that. Uh, this is a simple layout of the garden uh, and what to do in the spring as it divided up early summer. Winter was before that, late summer, I believe fall. So, you know, just different. He has it sectioned off for different uh, types of plants and what he's doing in the, the garden there. Okay, uh, a little bit on greenhouses. Uh, it goes into animals, uh, from butchering to raising. That's a pig. Um, how to build shelters for them, how to butcher them. All kinds of stuff like that. Does the same thing with shearing sheep. Uh, chickens, different types, a couple different ideas for, uh, you know, building the huts, or building their, excuse me, um, coops, things like that to butchering, uh, other fowl, beekeeping, uh, food, food of the fields is like grains they go through, uh, clearing land, chainsaw maintenance, uh, removing stumps, removing boulders, you pretty much name it, draining springs, splitting logs, types of wood, building fences, uh, a working horse, oats and rye, you name it, it pretty much covers everything here. Growing crops for oil, they have uh, ciders, how to make ciders, how to make wines, uh, food from the wild, uh, you know, fish and seafoods, uh, plants, nuts and berries, uh, how to make yogurts, um, your storage room, they have one how to make a, a thunder house, a out, outdoor uh, restroom, I guess, food storage, uh, making beer pretty much everything you need and some stuff you'd probably won't even use for uh, homesteading purposes crafts and skills goes through like basket making and you know building things thatched houses weaving wool and flax and uh, things like that pretty much anything you could think of how to build a furnace for the house a wood burning furnace um, things like that but I just wanted to share that with you because it seems like it's a really decent book. It has, uh, you know, working with metals and uh, you pretty much name it. Uh, if it has to do with being more self-sufficient, this book pretty much covers it in uh, pretty decent detail. Um, just thought I would share that with you. Like I said, it was a good deal. Got it for uh, uh, $12.50. It even has a dairy. You're milking your own cows, uh, making creams and butters, cheese, jam syrups, wine, mead, um, all kinds of stuff. But anyway, I want to share that with you. Check it out. I'm sure you can find it on Amazon. I'm just out here on my potting table at my garden. So uh, just wanted to share that with you. Thanks for watching.